The Singapore Navy's Information Fusion Center, or IFC, has formed security links with 100 maritime agencies in 42 countries. It's to counter threats like armed robbery. There have been five such incidents in the Singapore Strait in the first two months of the year. It follows a five-year high of 34 cases last year. While visiting the IFC at Changi Naval Base, Senior Minister of State for Defence, Zaki Mohammed, said international cooperation is vital in a complex maritime environment. If you look at the kind, kind of threats that we're having, the 34 cases were all out, although they call it Singapore Strait, it's all of Singapore waters. So they are actually in our neighbouring territories, in which IFC plays an even more important role to pass information on to our neighbours. So for example, a few of those cases, we're able to relay information to our neighbours so that they could act quickly and um, not contain and arrest the pirates. Just last year, the IFC shared the information regarding the attempted robbery of the vessel Sam Jaguar to the Indonesian Navy, who were able to act on the information and apprehend the suspects in Indonesian waters. The five armed robberies in the Singapore Strait this year are among 270 incidents reported. They also include collisions and contraband smuggling. These cases are handled with the help of international liaison officers at the IFC. The latest addition is a German officer who arrived last month. One incident we had uh, was a shipper that had a tea theft or an attempted tea theft uh, happening here in the Singapore Strait. And this company um, was contacting me directly and asking for further support, which we, with our connection to the IFC, was able to provide to the shipper.